Strategic planning is surrounded by hype and obscure concepts that can be quite intimidating. But really, strategic planning is the process of looking into the future and identifying how the organization wishes to align. It is simply the action of determining where an organization or department is going over the next few years and how it's going to get there. The strategic plan ensures the organization has a vision for the future and communicates that plan throughout the organization to ensure all departments and employees are working toward the same goal or cause. A strategic plan defines the scope of the work to be done, analyzes strengths, weaknesses, opportunities and threats, formulates focus areas, develops goals, creates action plans, measures success, and optimizes the use of resources. It's really that simple. So, what are the steps in strategic planning? Clarify the mission. Prepare vision and values. Conduct a SWOT. Identify four to six key focus areas. Develop strategic goals. Create action plans. Communicate and monitor results. And then adjust as necessary. Let's look at each step. Mission. A mission statement identifies why an organization exists, the primary customers, and the products and services offered. A mission statement reflects every facet of your business and your relationship with your customers, employees, and the community. Visions and values. A vision depicts what you would like the organization or department to be like in the future. A vision statement is a brief explanation to explain why the vision is desirable and it should communicate the organization or department's values, dreams, and priorities. Values are the guiding principles of the organization. Values create alignment and drive behavior. They provide the framework to help make decisions and focus on priority actions. The SWOT analysis. A SWOT matrix will help identify the strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, and threats for the organization, department, or product. A SWOT analysis can be very helpful for many endeavors within the organization. Focus areas are areas in which the organization or department will focus its attention on for the next one to three years. Leaders should assign ownership of each key function area to ensure objectives, planning and actions have a direct responsibility, and a chain of command has been identified. Strategic goals are statements of specific outcomes that are to be achieved. All aspects of organization should have goals, from strategic goals set by the organization to department goals set to meet those strategic goals and individual goals to meet departmental goals. Goals can be expressed as financial terms, market outcomes, social norms, or any other achievable goal. Goals should be smart, as in specific, measurable, attainable, relevant, and time-bound. Action plans. Action plans are simply the steps to take to meet a specific goal. There may be one or many steps for each goal. Each step should have an assigned responsibility, reporting, and deadlines. It's very hard to meet goals without a written action plan for which a person has accountability and deadlines. Communicate and monitor results. Communication is critical to the success of any plan. Communication can be written or verbal, but should always be recorded to ensure all parties understand the goal, actions, responsibility, and timelines. Written action plans, work plans, team meetings, debriefs, and regular reports are all ways to communicate and monitor results. And don't forget to share both success and failure. Failure isn't a bad thing. Consider failure as just another word for practice until we're successful. Goals may need to be adjusted as the organization, society, or something significant changes. Goals should change over time to reflect growth within the organization or department and changes to societal norms. And don't forget to start the review from the beginning. Has the vision changed? What about the mission or values? Updating your SWOT is critical to help you identify next steps. A strategic plan should not be a stuffy document on the back shelf collecting dust but rather a living document that is referenced and relied upon for organizational growth and decision-making. Put some life into your strategic plan 
and watch your organization or department soar.